Hey, what's up, guys? Carols. Uh, P.Y.'s here. I wanted to do a review on a gift I recently got um, for my birthday a couple days ago. Um, so, yeah, today we're going to do a review on some sunglasses. Um, before I made, you know, before I asked for the sunglasses for my birthday, of course, I, uh, I did do some research, as always. Love research. And um, so, in the past, you know, I've, I've spent, you know, hundreds of dollars, just like everybody else does, on nice sunglasses when I wasn't on the cheap program and, you know, didn't have any bills, didn't have any expenses. But now that I am on the cheap program, um, you know, I'm looking for good deals all the time and this is no different. Uh, with these sunglasses here. I, um, my last pair I had, I bought from Walmart. It was a pair of Penn sunglasses. Uh, man, uh, you know, same maker of the rod and reels. Um, so they were geared toward fishing. Decent pair of sunglasses. I paid like, I think 20 bucks for them. And they lasted a few years, but you know, they, they kind of had some rubber that uh, deteriorated the ears so I was like ah, I don't want to get them again you know it's just you know, I, I want to try something different that's the other thing I like trying different things new things of course and um, so yeah so then did some research obviously and went to a couple different websites uh, I went back to Walmart's uh, website and um, I, nothing really stuck out to me it was like you know it just not, none of them appealed to what I wanted um, a few characteristics that I did want or you know, what I was looking for was um, they had to be polarized um, and obviously the, the next probably biggest thing probably bigger than being polarized is the look they got to look you know appealing you know everybody has their own taste and whatever and um, you know so that kind of drove the search initially and then yeah, a couple of the other pieces of criteria, you know, like I said, polarized. Um, the style of the sunglasses, I guess that goes with the looks. But, uh, but yeah, so then I went to probably my favorite website, um, and that is Amazon. Um, and I, I might actually do a review on Amazon. I don't yeah, it's kind of crazy, but just to kind of, there's a lot to Amazon that people don't know about. But, um, but yeah, so I went to Amazon, and, uh, you know, punched in sunglasses and after a good amount of research um, I came to these the Hodgson's um, and my wife actually had said well what you know what about these or what about those or what about these you know and she was showing me like 50 to 100 dollars sunglasses and I was like you know I don't need that um, I need function I need you know comfort and it doesn't have to be hundred dollars you don't need to pay a hundred dollars for that I wear sunglasses I uh, you know daily so it's, it's I don't I don't see the need to spend a hundred dollars for something that's gonna probably get a little beat up um, you know so that's what brought me to the Hodgson's right here um, read the reviews on them obviously through Amazon and then I researched them online as well, and you know, everybody's giving was giving them good reviews. They looked appealing, um, so and they had they fit fit most of the criteria that uh, that I that I was looking for. So here they are, um, and they come. You know, this is how they come. Obviously in a Hodgson box. There's no with with Hodgson. They don't. Um, I think they're, they're different style of sunglasses. Uh, they're different styles. They go by numbers. And actually, I couldn't e even find the number of this style that I'm about to show you, um, which was kind of funny. Maybe I didn't do enough research. But uh, but yeah, so um, so I, I, this, this is the style that I wanted. This is, you know, again. So here we go, guys. So right out of the box. Um, you know, and there's some advertising on the box. I don't know. You know, obviously you see the logo there, a little bit there, and then on the back gives you a description. I don't know if I'm probably giving you an extreme close-up, but 
yeah. So basically, description on the back, just kind of, you know, thanking me for for purchasing them, and uh, giving me a little overview of them, uh, of what they're what they kind of stand for, I guess. So, and then as you can see, they also have UV protection, um, you know, a couple other advertisement type things there. So that's that. So then we get to the the case here. Case is pretty nice. I mean, for 20 bucks, you know, for it to even come with a case, uh, I'm, I'm pretty happy. Uh, it's got their logo, little logo right there. It's kind of rubberized. Um, the case is, is a hard, I would say it's a hard plastic. It's, it's, you know, it's nice. I mean, it's not bad. It's got like a little texture to it. It's like a um, mesh. And then you have a hook here. Uh, I, I would assume that maybe you can hook it on your pants somehow, you know. Uh, I probably won't do that, but uh, maybe, I don't know. So, um, so here we go. So, unzipper and then, and boom, there we go. So, they, sunglasses come in a plastic bag. They have this card here, I'll explain this in a few minutes what that is. And cleaning rag. Cleaning rag has their logo as well, kind of embossed. I think that's what they call it, embossed, maybe. So that's pretty nice, just a little microfiber cleaner rag. Inside of the case, it's got like, you know, a little, uh, I guess, what do you want to call it? Maybe felt? I mean, it's it's soft. It's, you know, it's not gonna scratch your glasses, obviously. They wouldn't do that, something like that. But, uh, yeah, it's got a little inlay. I don't know if you can see that. So the sunglasses will sit in there pretty nice. So that's that. All right, here we go, guys. So they come in this little plastic bag to protect it. Just chuck that there. So there we are. And they're pretty nice. Definitely, uh, I'm happy. I'm happy with the purchase, well, with the gift. Um, and again, just my personal style. But, uh, so when I looked Hodgson up there, they're geared toward like, outdoors type stuff, which is kind of a weird way to say it. most sunglasses are for outdoors. But what I, what I mean by that is like cycling, um, fishing, uh, yeah, I guess boating, obviously boating, fishing, same thing, um, hiking, you know, that's kind of how they, they push their product there. And, um, and then their lenses, they have a whole slew of different lenses. And I went with the, uh, they call these the Revo bright red lenses. And they're like kind of orange, but uh, but yeah, they call them the bright red ones, and they're for like um, you know strong light is what they say, uh, and they're Revo, which means it's again researching through Hodgson, Revo to that uh, they say Revo is like uh, it's clarity, it like makes the picture you know whatever you're looking at clearer. Um, polar polarized helps with that as well. Um, you know, as far as like glare, like especially when you're, if you're on the water, um, polarized, polarized sunglasses are definitely the way to go. And one of the reasons why I went with that because I do have a boat. So, um, but yeah, so they're they're and they're made of this uh, this TR90 frame, which they advertise as being unbreakable and flexible. Which it is. They're 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 pretty flexible. I'm not gonna go too crazy here. Honestly, I just got them. I don't really wanna you know, break them the first day I got them, but there is a lifetime warranty actually on the frames and the lenses. If you crack the lenses, the lenses are supposed to be unbreakable as well. So, um, as you can see, a little Hodgson logo right there. I don't know if you can see that or not. But they have, uh, they have some, some no on this particular model, they have a nose piece here that's adjustable, you know, adjust to your size. So they have some um, a little rubber or maybe hard plastic. Um, pieces here. It's, it's pretty cool. It's uh, well, that's pretty neat. It's kind of it goes through to the other side, and it kind of has a flex to it, meaning a lot kind of like is floating in there. So I guess it fits to your head. Again, don't know if you can see that. Probably can't see that, but yeah. So yeah, pretty good. I haven't even adjusted them yet. I mean, I probably will adjust them a little bit snugger, maybe. But I mean, they're not, you know. They don't feel like they're gonna fall off my head. They're really light, which is awesome. I like that a lot. Um, you know, so pretty cool. All right, awesome. So I hope you guys liked the video. Um,
think I covered everything that I wanted to cover. Um, oh, no, I did, almost forgot. So, so this little card here, it's kind of crazy, but so this card that they supply, it's actually the polarization card. That's what they call it. So what happens is you, so you, without the sunglasses on, it just looks like, looks like this. What you see, nothing. Then when you put the sunglasses on, you actually see the Hodgson logo comes through. Um, I guess that's proof that they're polarized. Not sure, but I'm gonna try and see if we can do this. I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but so, so yeah. So pretty cool, man. I, I'm definitely happy with the purchase. I'll definitely be wearing them, like I said, daily. So I, uh, I may even do a, a review in a couple months or a couple weeks to just for a follow up. Um, so yeah. So guys, thanks for watching. If uh, obviously, please subscribe. I'll, uh, I'm uh, new to YouTube, so just starting out. But um, like the video if I, you know, if I did a good job, and uh, throw some comments down there, and you know, a little uh, what do they call it? Constructive criticism. I, I don't mind that either. But um, you know, I'm gonna be bringing some more videos to you guys. Hopefully, uh, you know, you like them and all that. But uh, that's about it. So have a good one. And I'll see you next time. Thanks.